Hello everyone. Um, well, <laughs> I'm not even sure why I'm recording um, right now. I was actually hoping to get my, um, my, um, God, I almost did poop with me. Um, <laughs> my pull up today. Um, unfortunately, I came home to a delivery slip, um, which is a good thing because I had been following the, um, because you should never give me a tracking number. I literally kept clicking on it. Like I got it, um, got it Monday. I kept clicking on it all day yesterday and there was nothing that I clicked on today and suddenly boom, it was in Columbus where, um, where I live. <laughs> and, um, it said it was out for delivery and I was like, what? Um, so yeah, it was out for delivery. And um, then um, the Postal Service's uh, delivery tracking went down. And I was like, God, are you kidding me? Because, like, um, l the last thing it said was out for delivery, but it was from 8.37 that morning. So I'm like, did it do it? What happened? So, um, yeah, I got, I got, the, uh, got the delivery slip, um, but it was not on my door. So when I got home, um, I was, you know, getting a little bit excited. I'm like, she has to be here by now. So I get to the door, nothing. So I freak out. <laughs> I actually come in, scare my cats because like I slam my stuff down on the floor because I was carrying like a bunch of, um, groceries. Um, and, uh, I slam it down on the floor and go running up to where the, actual mailboxes are and um like I'm like freaking out kind of having like a like almost a panic attack like like oh my god someone stole her and I'll never see her again and blah 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 uh I was coming up with horrible scenarios like um I read about on um Den of Angels I read about someone who um the post the the post guy uh mail man there we go <laughs> had delivered their doll to an upstairs neighbor um, because they said, well, the package uh, was had like Asian writing on it and her neighbor was Asian. So why not deliver it to them to hold and since, you know, they weren't home. And I'm like, what kind of logic is that? Anyway, though, um, she was talking about how the woman um, ended up throwing the package away because I guess she opened it, it was dull, and she's like, what the hell, threw it away. And for some reason, that scenario immediately jumped in my head. I'm like, someone took my doll and threw her away, and I'm going to have to kill someone. So, <laughs> um, I get up there, and I don't see a package below the mailboxes. I'm like, why would they leave her there? But I hoped something like that. But no, I opened my mailbox, and here's the slip. I'm going to call them, um tomorrow because she's not going to be available for pickup till um, tomorrow and uh, see if I can come down Saturday to get her because I doubt I can get to the post office before it closes on a business day because I think it closes at 5 and I wouldn't get off work till um, if I got off work at 5 I wouldn't be anywhere near the post office because of the bus till like 6 so um so yeah, um, hopefully there will be a pull-up box opening Saturday. And it's kind of good She's I, I, if I can get her Saturday because then I can play with her that day. Um, even if I do go out to see Unstoppable, which I have to because Chris Pine's in it. Um, but <laughs> even if I do go out to do that, I can still like spend all day like playing with her and feeling around with her accessories, maybe take a lot of pictures with her and Steiner. Um, so yeah, and uh, I guess uh, that's my exciting after work day. Um, that and I'm not sure if there should be like a war word of warning to like people who are getting new into this hobby. And this may have something to do with like the large discussion going on currently on Den of Angels about sock dresses of all things. Um, it was mentioned... Like, I don't even know how this got brought up in the first place, but it was mentioned in um, the thread about, like, how, you know, if you can't, um, 
like if you save up for the doll, this expensive doll, you can't save up to get your doll an outfit or two, and maybe this isn't a hobby for you. And I was like, I understand that amazingly, because uh, after work today, I had to go get a whole bunch of these, which is just ramen, it's just fancy. It's from the actual um, Asian store, and I actually love this ramen, but still, I get to live off this for two weeks because I'm stupid. <laughs> I um, went ahead and, uh, you know, went got to pull up the, the Dalmore order, and now I have enough money, and I get to enjoy ramen and oatmeal for breakfast uh, for until my next paycheck, which is roughly two weeks from now. Um, which is awesome. <laughs> so like, um, yeah, I couldn't really afford the outfits, but it's threads like that that make me go, okay, okay. I kind of wanted to make the sacrifice and I kind of feel bad, but like, I didn't let that thread get to me because it was started after I made the decision about this. I just let little things like my doll looking a certain way get to me. Like, I don't want people to judge him because sometimes I do not have enough money for him. Um, and um, I know it's probably going to happen anyway because I've already seen judgment over just like the model of dog getting like, I saw today someone going, he's so weird looking and I was like, oh. <laughs> um, but I hear that a lot about him, which is funny because I don't think he's weird looking at all, but I guess that's just me. Um, well, not just me. I mean, me and the people who own him. Um, I mean, obviously, we don't think he's necessarily weird looking. I think he's definitely unique in a way. Um, he doesn't instantly remind me of another doll out there. Um, I know Sculpt isn't really that popular, but still, at the same time, I got, like, immediately defensive about it. And I know I'm probably going to be defensive about him. And it's going to be super annoying for me when I do that. But, I mean, I don't know what. So, yeah, I, I could change my Dalmore order because um, we have till the 21st. But I keep refusing to do that. I don't know. I may give it a thought or two. But there's some really good stuff I'm getting him. And I kind of want to have it for him when he arrives. So that he's looking his best and people won't say anything about how he looks because that would just be really frustrating to me. Um, so yeah, I know that's stupid, but I wanted to share that because I figured, you know, if anyone would understand that, that's people who have dolls. <laughs> um, so yeah, um, I don't have any other doll plans to share except I'm about to watch a um, doll opening by, um, what is it, Darkest um, Inui? Anyway, I can't pronounce it, but, um, and she has, she apparently got the, um, uh, mini feed Chloe full set. And I really want Chloe. I have, it's funny, like, I didn't know there'd come a point where there'd be a doll that I really, really, like, absolutely must have besides Rye. Like, when I saw him, like, I have to have him, but I didn't think there'd be another one like that. I thought, Maybe there'd be, like, one I'd be like, oh, I really do want to get that. But I didn't think there'd be a, I have to have that type of thing. Um, I wouldn't even know what to do with her if I got her. Um, and I don't necessarily need the full set, even though it's beautiful. Um, I heard a rumor that she was going to be available through, um, I'm not sure what they call it. I can't remember the name. Where, like, you can... Pick the body, pick the head uh, that the mini fee offers. I can't think of it. Um, build a mini fee? I don't know. <laughs> I heard that her head sculpt was going to be available through there. Um, but I'm not sure about her yet. I'm not sure who she could be. Um, I wish, while I love the um, mini fee bodies, like I've always been interested in getting one for my own because I love the way they work. Um, I wish she was taller because I think she'd um, be good for another character. But um, because of her height, I'd, f I'd feel weird about the other height dolls I'm getting. Um, so I don't know. We'll see. 
Um, but yeah, that's it. Yesterday, oh, and this is really, it was funny to me, but probably no one else. But <laughs> yesterday, it turns out that um, somewhere in the doll zone waiting room, like their friend got um, their wing to, and I got this huge thing of jealousy run for me. It's so funny because, and I couldn't tell what I was jealous of at the time. If someone else had got them, which is funny because I want there to be more wing owners. Um, it's like I had a possessive moment or that he, they got him first. I think it's a mixture of both because I really want him now. Um, I'm getting to that point where I'm like tired of watching opening videos and watch and looking at pictures and whatnot and um, I just want the real thing now um, but he'll be worth the wait and I do love watching other people open their dolls and the excitement and uh, just how beautiful they look and everything and then it's always exciting when uh, you get that person it's their first doll and you're just like oh yay <laughs> and um, so yeah uh, I'm learning patience. It's something you have to learn. Uh, I'm just not used to it. I'm used to instant things. You know, if I want cheeseburger, I'll go get it. If I want um, a CD, I'll download it, like off of iTunes. Or if I want, I don't know, I can't think of much else I get and need it right at now, like music, food, yeah. <laughs> but, um, I'm used to it being right there, but I'm not used to having to wait weeks for it all. Um, and not even just paying it off, because yeah, of course I have to wait until I make all the payments, but once I pay right off, I'm still going to have to wait at least probably two more weeks, and I'm just like, it's insane. So, yeah, I'm, something you'll have, I, well, I'll have to get used to in this hobby, especially since my next doll is going to be a boy and girl doll, and I hear the wait times for them is also crazy so I'm like damn I probably won't see him till March but we'll see what happens so um anyway yeah that is it I blathered a lot sorry about that and uh yeah um I guess till later <laughs> bye